Welcome back to Bean Monsters. This is a different voice than what you're used to. I'm Mike Bev from the development team and today I will be giving you a tutorial on how to change the ambient temperature on a monster truck track which is also applicable to any Beam and G map. I am also showing off Big Kahuna a little more today. Uh, this truck and the CRD 3.0 chassis will be available in the 2.0 date uh, incoming December 23rd. The current ambient temperature on tracks is hotter than it should be and is why the engine tends to overheat easier than it should. Uh, this was brought up by Nico, better known as Flying to Your Soul, a while back and I just now got around to finding and fixing the issue. Let's get started. First I'm going to show you where you can check the temperature in the game. Uh, first you want to go to the environment on the left hand side of your screen in the escape menu and it will show up in here. Apparently I got ahead of myself and already fixed this track but this should show up uh, around low in the low 90 degree range, uh, 92.3 degrees Fahrenheit I think. Uh, now we're going to go into the level editor. I prefer using the old editor over the new one but I believe it should carry over into the new one as well. Uh, to access the new editor, press Control F11. If you're using the old editor like me, it's Control Shift F11. But make sure your FM lock is on. Now that you're in, you want to go to the object tree on the right hand side of your screen. Uh, uh, the recording buttons are in the way for me, so I'm going to move this out a little bit uh, so I can access it. In the object tree, you want to open the mission group. Uh, this is called the object tree because it shows you all the parts uh, of your track, like the objects, the decals, the lights uh, that you have spawned. Uh, you want to open the level objects, uh, go to the sky folder, then click the level info, which is just as the name suggests. You want to look down below in the environment section for temperature curve C with the C meaning degrees Celsius. Uh, the game converts the Celsius to Fahrenheit to display. If you want a different temperature, go to Google. Uh, you can search up a converter and it can do the calculation for you. Uh, what we have here is a bunch of numbers that are spaced out and that are actually in groups of two. The first number being the time of day from zero to one and the second being the temperature in Celsius. What you want to do is copy this set of numbers from this description of the video, highlight all the numbers that are there, and paste. Uh, after this, you are good to save and go back into the game. Uh, go to environment again, and you should see 59 degrees Fahrenheit uh, as shown here. Adding this change to your zip is just like anything else with uh, level editing. Um, with the game update that came out uh, just a couple days ago, um, lighting has been broken for most if not all tracks that are not daytime. Um, there has not been a uh, fix for this yet. Once there is, uh, me or one of the other developers will get a tutorial video out for you guys. Uh, I will be updating a few of my tracks to have this temperature fixed soon with more after 2.0 is out. Uh, as you can see, I clearly know how to drive today as well. <laughs> um, thank you guys for watching and enjoy 2.0 when it comes out.